Hello, it's the one and only Queen Bipa. Welcome back to my channel, guys. If you're new to my channel and you'd love to be a part of my beautiful family, all you have to do is hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and follow me on all my social media platforms. The name is Queen Bipa. One word, I will put it down below. Um, and thank you so much to my regular, regular subscribers. Those who keep coming back to watch content from yours truly thank you so much i appreciate the love and support as you can tell by the title of the video guys i'm so sorry <clears throat> i just um came back from travel and i just thought to myself i have a lot of content to catch up on so i will be busy for the next two weeks and i just thought you know what i know i'm back and i'm tired and my voice sounds scrappy but I am still going to try my level best to push the content. This voice will have to bear with me. It will have to, you know, get with the program. So, unfortunately, I'm so sorry for this funny voice. But two, three days will be fine. Um, I think my voice doesn't um, do well with screaming anymore. I've gotten to the age where I, when I scream or sing out loud or shout, I come back with a voice like this. And it's hectic because... There's no cure for that. I will just have to nurse it um, for the next few days. So <clears throat> how I nurse it is that I use lemon, honey, hot water. So it was worse yesterday. It's much better today. Um, thank God I'm back safe. Um, I needed that travel. I needed it um, for my soul <laughs> and my spirit. But you know, guys, when I do travel, I do shop and shop, shop, shop. So in this um, vlog, or oh, this haul, you are going to see what I have bought over the past two months, uh, which I have not vlogged. So this is a collection of clothes and shoes that um, I have purchased in the month of August and September. So um, yeah, guys, I'm gonna take you through the haul. I have went to stores like YDE, I have went to Wing Girl, I went to Adidas Outlet, I went to Soviet. Um, so all these items I've purchased, purchased when I was in Cape Town. Um, Cape Town has the best clothing items. It has the best malls, the best clothing items. I'm not gonna lie. Um, sometimes it is value for money, sometimes it's not. I'm lucky enough sometimes to shop uh, where I shop and then I get the best buys or I get things on sale. So <clears throat> I'm glad that, oh Lord, I am glad that, um, yeah, I managed to buy what I bought. And I also will share the prices with you guys so that you see that I did not necessarily break the bank. Um, but yeah, some of these things. I shouldn't have bought but i just told myself you need to spoil <laughs> you need to spoil yourself once in a while i'm that girl that's stuck between saving or living your love living once doing you being happy yeah um somebody told me that i suffer from adhd because when i'm sad i shop when i'm happy i shop and when i'm like kind of in between me mixed feelings i shop so <laughs> I give her ADHD vibes. So, I don't know, guys. You tell me your comment down below. I know, yes, I'm still saving. I'm not so faithful, but I am saving, guys. I am definitely saving. There is definitely room for me to, <laughs> to improve. But, yeah, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. But it's more or less a disciplined thing, and it's not that easy. So, don't judge me. Don't judge without blabbing <clears throat> and making this video too long i'm going to start with wing girl my girl it's quite a lot i'm gonna put this plastic on the floor so that it doesn't disturb the lighting <clears throat> so the first item that i got from wing girl is this dress it's giving like Magula vibes, like Maliko Salam vibes. The lighting is too light, sorry guys. 
So the first item is this long, modest dress. It's giving Arabic vibes. Um, I've been loving the, I've honestly been loving the dresses on Sheen that are so modest and Arabic. I don't know why, uh, but um, I have a lot of those on my wish list. But when I saw this one, I was like sold because it is so beautiful. The texture is cotton and um, it's giving like a glittery <coughs> vibe with lining. Um, I bought this in a size, I think it's a, I don't even know what size this is, but it's, it should be a large. Yeah, there's no size here. Oh, this is a small. So they run very big. They run very, very big. It's just that it's a bit tight on my curvy area because yeah but it's very loose on top at the bottom it's just that the middle part um is a bit slightly tight uh but it's doable and um this is made way obviously in china that is the price of the dress i bought it for 190 love it so much as you can tell the way it fits me i'm gonna move a bit for a video on my <clears throat> left hand side so that you can see how it fits me so that is um the first outfit then the second one um um is this top which i will be abusing throughout this vlog because i was not wearing <clears throat> i was wearing like this so i couldn't put this top on top um of the new clothes so i tried it with this crop top it's a cotton top very cutesy very demure it's a very cute guys it's i bought it in a large from forever 21 um so i'm gonna bring it closer that you see the different textures styles and whatnot very thick uh, but there's no bra support on this one. I don't even know how I'm gonna wear this top without a bra because yes My boobs are a bit droopy here. You can see um, But I'll figure it out and this top uh, This top was 100 rand No, it was 60 rand. This top was 60 rand um, So yeah, I'm happy with this one. Okay, and then the next item are these pants Oh my gosh, these are perfect for winter. So they are pleather pants. They are so gorgeous. Obviously they are from Zara. They just been ripped out there, but I can tell that this is a Zara product. Um, these pants are so, so stretchy. Um, I did not get a size, so I scaled up because they run very big. Um, in the USA, they are a 12. In Europe, there are 44. Um, yeah, so I usually wear a 42 or a 40, depending on the kind of um, the cut. So this cut is a very accommodating, big, but you know, girls with tiny waists and big thighs have a gap at the back. So you can even see in this video that there's a gap, but I'll figure it out. I'm going to have to go and adjust them at my tailor. These pants are 190. Here's the price. 190. Um, I love the color. I have pleather pants in brown and black, but I just thought this is a pop of color might wear it maybe next year who knows but that's how i buy clothes i usually buy clothes because i am building some kind of a collection so these are part of my collection absolutely love them to bits and then we also have these ones these ones they are funny because i just thought they are ugly but before i left the store i was like no there's potential in these pants there's definitely potential. This is how it looks. I want to set them up so that you get the feeling of how the pants look. These are going to be perfect for summer. These, these are like one of those statement piece pants that you don't have to overdo anything. 
it is a statement on its own and I see that these pants with big pockets and hipsters are back in fashion so these are a bit of both um, the color speaks for itself and then it's high-waisted um, this is how cool the um, the top part of the pants look so it's got these buttons clip-on buttons two of them it's got hooks two hooks on the side and then a zip how cool is that you'll see when i show you in this video they run very big and long which is tall i'm not sure they've got these big pockets on both sides and they are like wide legged and giving you a boot hipster effect i love the back as well it's got these invisible uh pocket um closures or whatever you call them it's, it's also belted but i'm not gonna put a belt because it'll be a bit too much because this thing pulls it to become a belt gives it an illusion like you're wearing a belt i love these pants <laughs> obsessed um and these were 100 bucks they 100 bucks and i got a 44 it's also big but it's good because i wanted a loose effect and i wanted my waist to look much tinier so that at the at the um, on the hip side it's not too clingy or too tight so that's a 44 and absolutely love the way it hugs my body the ass in these pants honey <laughs> all right and then i got these formal blue pants what brand is this You're probably asking i don't know it's written forum i have no idea where that thing is from or which country or which brand then i got these ones also from these are not zara i think they're barushka barushka pens always fits me so well um to show you now they are blue tailor pants they look like suit pants very very beautiful like they should be blue dark blue it's just that the lighting yeah they are blue the lighting was just too light there um they are i bought a size 42 which is a size 10 and they stretch so they fit me so beautifully you can see it accentuates my waist my body my bums love it love them so much 10 out of 10 um these ones were 360. um you can see the 360 love them and you can style these so many different ways then i got these cute shorts um i bought this one in a size of 42 which is a 10 but they run a bit big so the 42 snacks my body so nice this is how they look they are linen pants and they're very short <laughs> they're very short they are literally below the bum um you can see in the video here but the way it hugs my booty 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 um these were going for 100 rand there's no price but they were going for 100 rand these are from a brand called city i don't know where it's from as you can see it's a 42 they're from city i don't know where it's from brazil mm, importer of brazil i don't know what brand that is but yeah i'm happy with them i love the way that it holds my body these are like a 10 out of 10 8 left no crumbs and then we got these formal white pants that can be slightly casual these are from zara you can see the tag i got it in a medium because it's got a elastic at the back which allows the pants to stretch very nicely so they are white and wide legged pants um i love them so much um i never thought a medium would fit but even a small could really really fit 
um i love the way it hugs my body i like the fact that it's not too tight around the waist area so it snags it so cutely um and then um how much were they these were also 300 and some 380 but there's no price here so you can see it's a medium there's no price there i love this you can style them high end you can style them casually you can style them however your style you know fits you or whatever you like but i'm gonna probably style this with a crop top i'll probably also style it a bit um formalish with a formal top like the navy the dark dark blue with those blue shoes i bought from steve madden it's an outfit i was thinking of that when i bought these love them so much um so that is one of the Okay, last but not least, I bought this bralette, bralette top. Obsessed. I'm thinking of that. This is how the bralette top looks like. It's got hooks at the back. These are elastic straps, so you can adjust them so that they, they fit the boobies. It doesn't really pull the boobies that much, but I can work with it. As you can see, I'm not even wearing a bra, um, but they look so nice. Really do look so nice so i'm thinking of styling this um with the orange short pants these ones and also with these pants this is what i was thinking of actually when i bought these um this top was uh which brand is this you're probably asking this is zara zara and i bought it in a large this top is uh 95 right um very classy very very classy love it and then i think that is it from wing and then we also went when i was in Cape Town, i went to um ydde i'll probably put a snippet of the kind of clothes that ydde is selling guys ydde they are expensive and some of the clothes you can even find it on sheen um a lot of them you can find them on sheen i don't know why um but this jumpsuit that i bought let me show you this is the jumpsuit i think i was so so doubting doubting i was doubting to buy this because of the price um guys you know that i don't like to buy expensive things um so but i thought to myself i really really want it i like it and i want it you know so this is how it looks this is the top part of the jumpsuit and then it's like uh what do you call it it's like a, a white leg and this is how the pants or the bottom part of the pants look like <coughs> like that okay sorry this is how wide the leg this is one leg this is how wide the leg is and this is how wide the other leg is i was quite shocked when i was fitting this that a medium couldn't fit me because there's no zip there's no button there's nothing at the back or the sides so you have to take it from the um bottom all the way up which i don't know why because if there was a zip even a small or a medium could fit but i had to take a large because of my curves things never pass by there so i had to take a large and this is a price <laughs> i bought this for a thousand rand cry with me <laughs> but it's gorgeous very very gorgeous thank you this is how it looks on me so this was quite expensive i've never bought a jumpsuit for that much so it's a statement piece which will have to last me years but i love it then um we went to macro and me and my mom were shopping at Marco all these good old days and I'm like I saw this I saw these shoes we put them aside I saw these shoes and I'm like wait a minute 
wait a damn minute. These have potential. These have potential. And I've been styling him with most of the clothes that I've fitted, as you can see. Yeah. Even the pictures, I'll probably put a lot of pictures here. But I don't have like a kitten slide on sandal. But this macro is not playing. They're a bit dirty because I've been fitting them in and out. This is not the original price. I got them on sale. They were 150. I got them on sale from 350 to 150. Obsessed is these are gorgeous. So we are done with YDE, Macro, and Wing Girl. Now we're gonna go to Adidas. There's a store that I usually buy my Adidas for quite a reasonable price. Um, it's an outlet. So you're definitely bound to find um, things that have been marked down or a range that is ending in Cape Town. It's at Sable, Sable Square, not far from Century City. I'm sure it is in Century City. So that's where I usually shop my for my um, clothes if I want to buy from Adidas. Um, and then uh, they're quite reasonable, even though I feel like here I probably overspent, but it was because I wasn't buying necessarily for myself. I'm gonna show you what I bought my nephew. It was his birthday on the 5th of September, but unfortunately I was not around. And um, I've been on off WhatsApp for quite some time, so I didn't necessarily speak to him on his birthday. So um, I decided to buy him something in Cape Town. I'm just gonna show you now. So um, I bought him this nice top. I'm obsessed with this top, guys. This is the cutest top ever. It's written Adidas Day. It's written Adidas in the middle. And it's got like these cool effects. Um, you know, he's a soccer buddy, so he probably like it. It almost gives me like Pirates vibes. Like Pirates, a soccer team. I don't even know if he's a fan. But yeah. Um, and then I got this one for 50% off. That's the price. Um, so it was quite reasonable not bad really not bad but this shirt I've never seen anything like it and I just thought it's cool even here it's got the Adidas um, logo very very cool I really do hope it fits in me he's quite a skinny fella um, so they didn't have um, size 15 to 16 so I'm gambling on Taking this one, which is a 13 to 14, um, yes, but it does stretch a little bit, and yeah, okay. So, I've already shown you this one, and then I got him a cap to match. The cap is not that expensive, nothing to run home about. It's 30% off, that's the price. So cute, right? I, I would have even wanted to buy it from this. The cap is really nice. And then I also bought him these sandals. These are cute, man. These are so, so cute. Um, so he's gonna match. He just probably needs nice pants to match the price. So, yeah, I spent quite a lot there. But um, I hope he likes them. And I hope he's happy. And then I myself the stop scream with me <gasps> love it so much it's my favorite color it's nude I bought this in a large so it's like a a shirt dress size so 8 to 10 I would have loved it to be like a 10 to 12 it does fit but it's very short so i don't think i'll wear it alone i think i will probably wear it with like a bum short or a jorts i need to buy myself some jorts this will go well with nice short pants and i saw angel bought these other jorts from edgis i think i need to visit edgis so that i get those jorts love them this is the price of the top 
and love it so much. This logo looks very unfamiliar. You can never even say that it is, but it looks so cool. So, so cool. Um, and then last but not least, um, the star of the shop. Um, got these sneakers. Can't scream because I'm missing my voice. But these these are gorgeous. Gorgeous. It's got gold logo here. That's how they look in front, side, back. I tried my little best not to buy these, but I was like. I'm never gonna find anything like this. Anyway, anyway, the material is like um, this suede or cotton, suede or cotton or velvety. I don't know if you can, it can come across on the video, but these, oh, these are gorgeous. These are gorgeous. Um, so much. Um, probably asking how much they were. That's the price. One thousand five hundred, but thirty thirty percent over that. Um. So yeah, the shoe is a stunner. Stunner shoe. Stunner. Hella fine. Love her. Love her so much. And then there's another pair that I bought from Soviet. So I see a lot of people have been loving these sambas. But for me, I was like, I would never buy such a shoe. But funny enough, the men's wanted a um, a duplicate of the shoe uh, at a cheaper price. So I said, no, I saw on TikTok this other girl once bought it. And then I munched it and I said, one of these good old days, I am going to visit... Um, Soviet to check if they are available. So I went to Access Park and then I got myself the duplicate of Sambas um, but the Soviet one. So it does look exactly like the Samba. There's the design of the shoe. That is the price of the shoe. They are 400 grand and I think Sambas retail between 1.3 to probably 2.5 because I've seen the other colors of Sambas. Perfect. Um, so open the box. That is exactly how they look like. So they look exactly like some of Exactly. So that is how the shoe looks. It's written so weird. That's the front. That's the other side. That's the back. And that's the front. So you see, it's really giving the samba effect. But this is so weird. How gorgeous. Can't wait to rock these. I can't wait to style them. Probably gonna style them also with these pants. The white elite as our pants. Um, so I didn't break the pant here. Yeah. I got it in a seven because of my toes. But I got these ones in a six because the seven was too big. So I am happy. Happy girl. So um yeah guys that brings me to the end of this vlog if you have watched until this far don't forget to like this video don't forget to comment down below on the favorite item that i have displayed in this haul and what probably you're most likely to buy and then um, yeah don't forget to also follow me on instagram the name is queen Bipa. i'll put the name down below the handle down below i meant to say um without wasting any further time i'll see you in another vlog and in another video love you loads wish me well with this voice i'm so sorry this video was so hectic <laughs> 
probably felt my pain through me talking, but content must go on. The show must go on. Love you lots. See you next time. Bye.